hi guys you're welcome back to my youtube channel abr tech in this tutorial i'm going to be guiding you on how you can verify your binance profile to be able to transact freely without being duped on this platform so if you are new to this channel please hit the subscribe button then the notification bell icon so that you will be notified whenever we drop new content like this all right so in this tutorial i will be walking you on how i was able to verify my basic profile the intermediate but since i'm not a seller on finance i don't think i really care much about the advanced features all right there are three kinds you need to verify the basic the intermediate and the advanced okay so if you have this app on your phone just open it straight and in case you are new to it you're supposed to download the app then we write on okay so we're gonna be opening this we're gonna be opening this um Binance when you open the Binance all you need to do is to first of all locate 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 the locate the profile the profile tab okay now as it is i'm logged on to my profile and this is my profile tab in case you're not logged on to yours just log on to yours all right so this is the profile tab just wait for it to load you can see that i'm verified all right i'm verified on this platform and i can buy more than 100 dollars like 300 dollars worth of crypto 200k worth of crypto because i have the basic and the intermediate verified already okay so the process is quite a very simple one but recently they stopped some kind of verification for non non-europeans like nigerians during my own time i was able to verify my own account with um bvn and nin so i was able to use my own destiny my 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 knee slip all right so you can see that i'm verified there the intermediate version and you can see the binance privacy policy but before you can continue you should understand their privacy policy their terms and conditions in case you're not comfortable with them you may choose to just quit all right you may choose to just quit but in case you are comfortable with it you can further you can forge your head and do the verification and start selling and buying on binance it is only on binance now that you can be able to sell to pay to pay with safety right so what you're gonna be doing here look at the basic the basic and i can i can send 300 dollars worth of crypto deposit and withdraw 300 worth of crypto every day okay i can be able to do that every day I can be able to do that every day and on the, on the that's the basic story got some kind of discussion and i can be able to withdraw my deposit of crypto is unlimited and the withdrawal is 2 btc daily all right so on the intermediate i can deposit up to 50k all right these are the things you need to do they are all basic requirements government id and facial verification okay the government id i was able to use my my name sleep as a nigerian my name slip room voters card used to work but currently you can only use international passport and driving license okay if you have international passport and driving license you can use it and my daily is 50k deposit 50k dollars withdrawal and 500k monthly 500k withdrawal i can withdraw all the dep my deposit is unlimited and i can withdraw 100 btc do i have such amount of btc on my account so there is no need but there is still need to avoid some kind of um controversy okay there is still need to avoid some kind of controversy and here is the advanced version i'm not verified yet okay my verification i failed the other time while i tried to use account statement from my mobile app so this time all you have to use actually is to go to your bank request for bank verification just snap the front page all right showing your ledger everything then you upload that you are good to go or proof of address you can input your address everything okay so if i want to verify again i will just have to click on verify again and i'm on the lane all right 
so that's the, those are the things you need so this is my address i'm going to be using a fake postal code here because it's not real i'm not going to make any research or maybe impute my but this is it i'm not continuing i want to show you what you're supposed to do all right so i'll be writing it to put it in upload when it comes to uploading of a um, picture or maybe the files they needed like the bank statement utility bill all right like your utility bill should show your address it should be same as your address i mean nepa b but whether nepa b gas water sewage fiber broadband service anything it should show it should show your address with your address everything works okay for the bank statement like i said go to your bank print your bank statement recent bank statements then snap or scan from cafe then upload when you upload you click on continue you are good to go all right so if you want to if you, if you want to upload this um this um this this this, this image okay you can see the sign of um the sign of camera there that sign of camera is the only thing you need to click before you continue all right the sign of camera you need to only click on the sign of camera and when you click on it you locate the the image the image is scanned all right the image is scanned or you either scan or you upload or you snap sorry okay you either scan or you or you or you snap it all right with this kind of um, camera you seen you click on it and it, and that very logo you click on that very logo and you upload okay so i'm gonna be doing this as an example you take or upload from gallery just once then i move to any of those images just let me let me okay let me go to my album i won't have any image to use here let me go to my album and in my album i'm gonna be picking this keyword reset is that i make or okay let me use that man on tie okay i'm using that man on tie you wait for it to upload and it should show like this before you click on continue okay you should have something like this just wait your picture format should be in pdf jpg jpg png file and no more than five megabytes take note so resize your image before you upload get image resizer from google play store resize your image something below five megabytes or you can just screenshot it crop it and you are good to go it will reduce the image size automatically when you take the snapshot screenshot screenshot then crop and upload that is the simple thing to do okay okay so just click on confirm and you are good to go all right so keep watching to the end keep watching to the end please 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 don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel hit the subscribe button subscribe please